Okay, this is just a, a summary on earning money. Um, you should pause the video here and make sure that you um, read and understand the different types of way that you can earn money. I'm just going to go quickly through it. Um, the first way that you can earn money is through, through a salary. Um, a salary is a fixed amount that is paid for the entire year. So from week to week, um, you get the same amount of money. A wage, that's usually uh, paid weekly to a permanent employee and based on an hourly rate for an agreed number of hours per week. So instead of getting paid the same amount every week, um, you get paid f per hour that you actually work. Uh, casual is a fixed rate and is paid per hour. The worker is not employed permanently and only works when they're needed. So um, if you've got a brother or sister that works at Macca's, they're probably a casual employee. Uh, commission is another way, we're going to look at that later, and um, piecework is basically where you get paid based on the number of things that you make or things that you do. So there's a lot of advantages and disadvantages um, to each of those, so you need to read through them and make sure that you understand them before you move on. Okay, so when we're looking at earning money, it's important that we understand a few things first. Um, in the first, the first thing is that in converting from yearly salaries or wages to monthly, fortnightly, and weekly amounts, we need to make sure that we realise that one year is 365 days, 12 months, 52 weeks, or 26 fortnights, and that those are numbers that are going to be helpful throughout this, uh, throughout these questions. Okay, so Monica is paid $21.60 five per hour for her casual work. How much does she earn if she works six hours in one day? So to work that out, you need to multiply the number of hours she works by how many, how much she's paid per hour. The final answer will be $129.90. Next one, is she works six hours per day for five days. So we've already worked out how much she's earned should do for working six hours in one day. So obviously all we've got to do now is multiply that by five. So as you can see, we've um, multiplied together her pay per hour, the number of hours she's worked, and the number of days she's worked for. Our answer is $649.50. Okay, so let's move on to this next question here. Uh, Angus works a 35-hour week and is paid $17.80 per hour. How much does he earn in a year? So even though there's only one question in this, cent in this paragraph, um, we're going to make sure that we work out the two parts. So he's... First of all, we need to work out how much he earns per week, um, and then we'll work out how much he earns per year. So to work out how much he earns in a week, we multiply the number of hours by how much he earns per hour. So multiply $17.80 by $35 to get $623. Now we need to find out how much she earns in a year, so we multiply it by 52 to find out how much she earns for the entire year. His annual income is $32,396. We're now going to look at uh, another one, which is just a little bit different. We're sort of going backwards now, so we need to convert an annual salary of $47,424 for a 35 hour week to a weekly salary. Okay, so we're going to go backwards now. So we went from how much he earned per hour in a 35-hour week to how much Angus earned in a year. Now we're going to go from converting an annual salary of $47,424 for a 35-hour week to a weekly salary. So because we know that there's 52 weeks in a year, we need to first of all divide by 52. So, 
$912. Next thing we need to do is find out the hourly salary. We've worked out how much he earns per week, but now what we want to do is find out uh, how much he earns per hour. We know that he earns works for 35 hours in a week. So we divide how much he earns but in a week, which is $912, by 35. That gives us $26.06.